So now let's see how we can use the Simplify Curves plugin to simplify animation curves inside of Blender. So to do that, first of all, I'm going to bring in an object. So I'm going to go, go around and bring in a torus. And now I'm going to record its motion. So I'm just going to go around 10 on the auto keyframe and I'm going to play the animation, press Z, and then I'm just going to go around and then make this animation right here, as you can see, just like this. So there you go, I got this animation of a figure. So that is what you have, and right now what you're having is that you're having a lot of keyframes right here. So I'm going to go around over here onto uh, the mode, and then I'm going to go around, select out the graph editor, and now you can see that this is not a very smooth graph. It's actually uh, individual keyframes right here, so each of the frame are recorded out right here. So let's say I want to simplify this. So when uh, everything is selected right here, so all of the uh, yeah, the keyframes, the graphs would be selected. And now what you got to do is you got to simplify it. So to do that, first of all, you need to enable out the plugin. So to do that, I'm going to go to edit right here. I'm going to go to preferences. And over here, you can see simplify curves is an option right here. Once you enable that out, you will have access to an option. So to access that out, I'm going to press F3 on my keyboard and over here in the search area, uh, simply click on um, simply type in simplify and you'll have the simplify F curve option right here. Once you click on it, what happens is that you got the simplify F curve, increase out the error right here. So right now it's zero, increase out the error. And what happens is that everything, the motion gets simplified as you can see right here. So as you increase um, the simplification, as you may increase, uh, decrease out the error, what happens is that sometimes animation data gets removed. So you gotta find that sweet spot where um, the uh, data is there. It's not deleted out right here, but it is still smooth. So you can see that still here, like not the data is not changed very much right here. So now uh, as you go around and play this, you notice that it is much more smoother compared to what you had in the beginning, as you can see right here. And that is how you can work around with simplifying of F, F curves, that is animation curves inside of Blender. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.